As, uh, the British Prime Minister, Boris Johnson, in his very first day, full day, I should say, at the House of Commons, he apparently, according to the Express, on a collision course with Brussels over Brexit. I mean, it's pretty inevitable, wasn't it? I'm smiling because I was in Parliament yesterday and I think he was on fire. I think he was wiping the floor with everybody on who were asking him what would have otherwise have been difficult questions. Well, it they was certainly so lively, I'll give you for that. Him, it was lively, it was entertaining, and I think it was inspiring. I had to do a sales talk after that, and as a businessman, I was actually more confident and more inspired. Now I'm not Why? a barometer. Why? Just, just, out of, just out of curiosity. That level of, it was, you know, he's been criticised for arm waving and being optimistic and all <laughs> the rest of it, OK? And they say, oh, light on detail. But actually, no, I don't think he's light on detail. I think there's a whole bunch of civil servants who are very uh, uh, fixed on the detail. And we'll talk about immigration for a start on mm. detail in a second. And also EU plans. But without that first step, of being positive about the country. You know what he said? He said, this is an exceptional country. This is a country which could be one of the greatest in the world. You might say, oh, God, no, no, let's just be pessimistic. Let's have the British disease of just being negative and talking ourselves into negativity. Of course you need. You've got to start off with that because that's what inspires the business people to begin with, who, who then hire people, who then have... We had more sales yesterday than we've had in quite a while, well, partly because I was all jeered up when we were doing the sales <laughs> conference call. We had more exports as a result. Now, that's not a barometer for the whole rest of the country. There's a whole bunch of pessimistic people out there who are going to be tweeting me saying, no, no, I'm suicidal. Let, let's Actually, just, let's it's just, important to be optimistic. I, I, I agree with that. It's important to be optimistic. However, let's just take sentiment out of this for a moment. He does say things that appear to contravene certain rules, regulations, laws. I mean, for example, he reiterated this idea that the UK would, could withhold its divorce bill, this £39 billion worth, if a no deal was forthcoming. Oh. I mean, the Attorney General, the, the official legal advice to the government is that that is not right. I mean, you can't make claims like that, can you, on yes, your you first can. day? In the I, I can Commons? tell you, as a, as a barrister, 50% of all cases end up with one side, one barrister being wrong and the other one being right. Uh, uh, if you've had an well, act of God like the referendum, an act of God like the referendum, you are, and you're a sovereign state on top of it, uh, you're well within your rights to say, well, actually, every, the agreement gets thrown, out of, uh, 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 gets thrown out of the water, as it were. Okay.